Alright guys, how's it going? And welcome to the Mo Ground home of Dresley FC. We have made a relatively short trip here today uh, to watch a little bit more of non-league football. Uh, obviously we made our way to Ashby Ivanhoe on uh, Saturday and watched a disappointing performance from Ashby as they were beaten 3-0. Uh, Grizzlies opponents today are Newcastle Town FC. Uh, but this is quite a big game for both teams. Grizzly uh, looming just above the relegation zone, I think, uh, I believe roughly uh, 20th place. Newcastle are 16th, uh, so they'll be looking to get a big win for them today and uh, get themselves clear of the relegation zone, whilst Gresley pretty much will be wanting to do the same, get three points and try and push themselves further away from the drop zone, as this is actually step seven, I do believe. Uh, so we're not far away uh, from the EFL at the minute. Um, obviously, as per usual, I got a stab in the dark my score prediction. Uh, the lowest scoring game that we've had so far in these non-league games was just that three goals at um, Ashby. So hopefully we see quite a few goals today. I reckon Newcastle will just edge it. Uh, so I'm going to go with a 2-1 Newcastle victory. Uh, but yeah, of course, we'll find out soon. And it's nice to be down to another local match. So we'll see you guys when the teams come out. Come on, Gresley. Yeah. Yeah. South Division game, yeah. 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 I would like just to mention as well that it's uh, Andy the Kickman's birthday today. Yeah. 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 Okay guys, so it's half time here. It is Gresley nil, Newcastle Town nil. Although probably not a nil-nil game, you could argue. Uh, when both sides have played football, they've both had chances. Uh, but at the minute, neither of the, uh, neither of the two teams have taken them. Uh, Newcastle probably popped up with the best chance around halfway through the first half. Uh, when their winger weaved his way through and fired a shot, but that was uh, well saved by the Gresley keeper. And then a similar effort, but on the other side, uh, by a different player, once again, saved by the Grizzly keeper. Um, sorry, yeah, so, sorry, saved by the Grizzly keeper. And then chances for Grizzly have come few and far between. They've got lots of uh, balls forward, but uh, not really connected with any of them. The best chance coming when their uh, striker has headed a cross, uh, but it was just wide of the goal. And I don't think this game's going to finish, no, no, I'll be honest. I can just see one side nicking it. And I'll back Newcastle to do that. It'll be finished 1-0 Newcastle, though 2-1 could still happen. Uh, but yeah, we'll see you guys when the teams come back out. Come on, Gresley.
Okay guys, so it is full time now, we are of course back home, uh, it did go on to finish, uh, Grasley won, Newcastle Town won, uh, so two second half goals, one in probably the first sec uh, the first minute and one in the last minute, uh, so like Newcastle uh, took the lead uh, probably around 47 minutes in, uh, when their number nine sprinted forward and uh, Whilst one on one, took a really nice shot actually. Uh, looked to go in off the post, uh, no chance for the keeper. Uh, but then Grizzly really started to apply some pressure on the Newcastle back line. Uh, they had a few shots go over the bar and uh, also forced the Newcastle keeper into a good save slash punch away, if you will. Uh, but then, of course, they did get one goal, and a really nice goal, actually, in what, if you include added time, was probably around 95 minutes in. Um, Bassett picked up the ball on the edge and fired a really nice shot into the top left-hand corner. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it was uh, quite an, an entertaining game to watch. Uh, there was quite a few times uh, where there was handbags um, involving... Newcastle's number 11, who, I have to be honest, probably should have been sent off. Uh, but, hey-ho, you know, Gresley will be happier with the point, probably. Uh, but will also be slightly frustrated, because they could have easily gone and grabbed all three uh, if they weren't wasteful with their chances. Uh, but, yeah, of course, Burton travel to Cardiff on Friday, as the preview for that will be up on Thursday for a change. Uh, I will also be going to that game, so that video will be out hopefully Friday night. So, thank you very much for watching this video, and I'll see you guys next time.